Good Tuesday morning, everybody. I'm meteorologist Brett Luna. We're going to start things off this morning with a viewer photo. This was sent in to us from Randolph. He took this in Renova. Nice sunset shot from yesterday evening, sunsetting right over that tree line. We saw mostly sunny conditions in Bolivar County and then in parts of Washington County. We did see some areas with total sunny skies. So overall, a pretty nice day for us yesterday, especially compared to what went through northern Alabama with those tornado warnings, severe thunderstorm warnings, and all of that active weather over there. But for us overnight, we haven't seen any rain here in the Delta over the past six hours. We have it stayed very dry. However, you will notice just a little bit northwest of Little Rock, there have been some showers that have started to form. As the morning goes on, these will continue really on this southeasterly track, and that will bring the rain to our area as we go through the morning and really throughout the day today. So for today, just expect some scattered light showers that will be possible. 51 right now in Greenville with winds coming out of the west northwest at 15 miles an hour. So definitely no wind chill to worry about in Greenville over in Greenwood. Similar story 52 for the current temperature. Winds are a little bit variable in Greenwood at seven miles an hour. Also no wind chill to worry about and for everybody around us. That's where we're at as well. 52 up in Clarksdale. A little bit better further south you go, 54 is for Vicksburg and for Jackson. And then over here in the northeastern part of the state, temperatures are fairly similar to us here in the Delta. 52 in Starkville and 54 to start this morning off up in Tupelo. So we are expecting the chance for just some light scattered showers as we go throughout the day today. Most of us, however, I think will stay dry. About 30% of us probably will see some showers moving through. Futurecast by 8 o'clock has some of this rain really along I-55 and just south of Greenwood along 82. And then as we go on into your lunch hour, some of those showers will continue to move on through the Delta. But once again, no heavy rain expected for today. No thunderstorm activity, really just some bits and pieces of rain moving through parts of the Delta. All should be light, no heavy rain expected. And then as far as the cloud cover, we'll start the morning off mostly cloudy, go through most of the afternoon mostly cloudy. And then as we get towards the very later part of the afternoon and into the early evening hours, we should start to see some breaks in our cloud cover and then go partly cloudy by tonight. And then tomorrow morning, we're going to start off the morning dry and then stay dry throughout the rest of the day tomorrow. Winds will be remaining out of the northwest, so we're expecting clear skies and dry conditions for Wednesday. Here's a quick breakdown for today. Low to mid 50s by noon. As we go a little bit further into the afternoon, we'll be in the upper 50s, mostly cloudy for most of the day. We will be breezy, though. Northwesterly winds at 10 to 15 miles an hour with some gusts reaching 20 and 25 miles an hour. But for tonight, we're going to stay very cool. 38 northwesterly winds only at 5 miles an hour. So we are looking at the chance for some patchy frost to develop across our far northeastern counties. Tomorrow, staying a few degrees below average, but warming up 62 for the high temperature under sunny skies and your seven-day forecast. We're going to stay dry going into Thursday as well. 68 Friday, just a very low chance for some showers. 74 for the high temperature. And then over the weekend, we're just going to bring in a 20% chance for some showers and thunderstorms, but stay warm over the weekend. 76 on Saturday, 78 on Sunday. And then going into early next week, we are looking at just a little bit better of a chance for some showers and thunderstorms to move through on Monday.